Right. Hello, Mitchell. It's Simon Says from Says and Said. Uh, we are solicitors. Now, right. now uh, my client has contacted me and asked me to contact you regarding an assault uh, on the domain on Saturday morning. Uh-huh. Are you aware of the incident? What's that? My client says that he was walking on the domain and he saw someone uh, in, under a bonnet of a car. He went over to, to talk to them and the person hit them with a, a spanner. Now, we've had the, uh, got the details of the vehicle. I'll do what you've got to do. You, you, you are aware of the incident, aren't you? I can tell. No, mate. I don't know what you're talking about. Right. Well, I'll, I'll describe it again. Uh, my client was walking on the domain, he noticed someone under the bonnet of a car, went over to see if he could give assistance, and the person swung round and hit him with a spanner. Yeah, right. Were you on the domain on Saturday morning? No. I find it hard to believe in that he did have the details of your registration. We've contacted the police to get your details. We've talked to your mother. Right. So what, what do you want to do? No, nothing really. You don't want to do? No, I don't want to do nothing. I'm wrong. Well, do you know, do, are you aware of the incident? Yeah, yeah, righto. You are aware of the incident? Yes, mate. Well, describe what happened from your point of view and we can come to some sort of arrangement. Oh, can we? I'm right. I'll, I can look after myself, mate. Well, it's not about looking after yourself. You certainly can look after yourself after you, you assaulted our client. Did I? <laughs> what do you th- how would you describe it? Uh, I'd rather keep that to myself, mate. I'm not too worried about it. Not too worried about it? Well, he is. No, no, well, good on him. That's the point. He's worried about it because he was assaulted and hurt and, and, and sustained injuries which have cost him uh, money. And he wants, he wants to redress that. He would prefer not to proceed through court. Uh, what would he prefer to do, mate? He'd prefer to talk to you about the incident uh. and get some financial compensation from you. Well, I, didn't, I don't know whether he got injured or not, do I? But you know you hit him. Did I? Well, did you? Tell me what happened from your point of view. Obviously, you've acknowledged the incident, so... Oh, well, he sort of come a bit close, so I told him to back off, and he didn't. Told him to... You told him to back off. What do you, yeah. mean, he came, what do you mean he came close? Oh, well, he sort of pulled up beside me, and he's out. I beg your pardon? Yeah. He, he was nude? He was, yeah, he was presenting himself in a... not a very well manner. What you would do at public. Are you serious? Yeah. I, I think you're making that up, because he did not provide any details like that. Hey? He did not provide any details like that. No, didn't he? That's no good. What, you're saying that he was indecently exposing himself? Yeah. Are you just making it up? No, mate, I'm not making it up. So, what, you're saying he indecently exposed himself? Yeah. And he, what, and he approached you from behind? Yeah. And what happened? Well, I told him to back off and he didn't, so i come on to him. Right, and what happened then? Oh, not much. Well, he, he's, he's denying that. He's saying that, uh, in fact, he was just re- trying to render assistance to you, thinking that uh, you might need some assistance with your car. No. What, you're saying he had his weapon out? Yes, he had his weapon out, mate. What state was it in? What state? Yes. What do you mean? Well, what condition was the... the... Oh, what do you reckon, mate? You, you, obviously, if, if you've seen it so clearly, what state was it in? What did I say? I saw it so clearly, clearly did I? Well, you obviously... Well, now you're saying you didn't see it clearly. You're assuming that. Well, you're saying you didn't see it clearly, so do, what, you're making this up, are you? What? No, yeah. you're the one saying that I saw it clearly, mate. Well, you, you described it pretty well before. You said he had it out. Yeah, I didn't describe it at all. Well, what... I think you better go and get your facts right, mate, and then give me a call back. Well, I'll give you a call back when I tell you you've got caught on a crazy call. Gotcha! Oh, good on you, Dave. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thanks, mate. Who did that? Lorraine. Oh, she's a bitch. <laughs> your grandma. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's her. Ha, ha, ha.